Hello and welcome to another Let's Play. Me, Game of Six of StarCraft. On the last Let's Play, we started this, you know, game where we tried to get the Chrysalis uh, to be evolved, that being her. Infested Kerrigan. But she's evolved. And now we, uh. You know, we benefit to that. It's a boy. To do. Boop. So wait, do we only have one? Or did we just. Really, we evolved that quickly. Or maybe we just have those things initially? Huh. Unknown. We usually... We just don't have those things that eat quickly. We might want to get those things just in case. Why? Because reasons. I mean, if it gives me free stuff, I... I do benefit. I do like that. Hey, you know. You know what it want. Amazing, isn't this our homeworld? We should know the general idea of our uh, topography, you know? Because that is home field advantage and all that. Well, I guess one of you guys will become these things. All the forces are under attack. Where? Well, probably is insignificant because we already defeated them. So, how about them next? Our forces are under attack. Huh. Cool. Well, it couldn't hurt to send one of these guys over here to uh, make it a bit easier on them. Or, you know, them. Yeah. There's a lot of orifices with regards to the Zerg. Just saying. Fume Carapace. Okay. So right. We need some of you guys to preferably care. Carry Kerrigan to some place so she can go do something. I mean, there seems to be a gap right here, so. <clears throat> yeah. Because there's not a gap. There's a bit of a gap, but not much. There's entire screaming of a gap, and there's not a gap. So we are. 
Not sure how much her damage capacity is for that, but uh, we'll figure that out. Which evolution? There's quite a few of them. So you're here, and everyone's there. Oh God, scratch me nose. Oh, uh, not there. Damn, it actually moves with the pace. Yes, Sarah Our forces are under attack. Right, that doesn't uh, hide her invisibility. Makes them a bit more than just transport units, or slow transport units, at least. Our forces are under attack. Our forces are under attack. Less than ideal. Actually, yeah, we get him here. Come on. All units. What is it now? A gold move. All 
right. Yes, Cerebrate? On my way. Hold there. Because it'd be hard for the enemy to, uh, you know, get any resources from that. Part is not so much fine. Our forces are under attack. But those guys can handle it there. The hive cluster is under attack. Safety save. Yeah. Because the AI isn't smart enough to be like, hey, let's not build guys next to, uh, guys that are actively killing us. I should be smart to play the long game.
Can you shoot them at that range? I mean, if it works, it works, I guess. I didn't want to be too, you know, presumptuous, I guess. All forces are under attack at speed gas. Sarah, is that really you? To an extent. I'm far more than I once was, Jim. You shouldn't have come here. But the dreams... I dreamed you were still alive, that somehow you were calling to me. I was. While I was in the Chrysalis, I instinctively reached out to you and Arcturus telepathically. Apparently, Arcturus sent Duke here to reclaim me. But that was then, Jim. I'm one of the Zerg now, and I like what I am. You can't imagine how this feels. So, what? Are you gonna kill me now, darling? That is certainly within my power. But you're not a threat to me, Jim. Be smart. Leave here now and never seek to confront the Zerg again. Doesn't look like I have much choice. I'm a goth girl now, so never confront me again. Ex-boyfriend. Kirkin, the noose and most powerful agent of the Overmat, has arisen from her embryotic cryostasis, but her formidable powers are still not fully functional. Kerrigan, while hot and also hot, must now seek to unravel the ghost con conditioning that keeps her powers in check. Once done, she will lead the other man's minions to complete domination over the unsuspecting Pretas. Horny Cluster. The primary Sarah Horny Cluster. Good. You watched over me during my incubation, and I am grateful to you. It is my wish that you continue your vigil so that I might strengthen my powers to better aid the swarm. I have been unable to access the totality of my latent powers, and as such, I would like to infiltrate a Terran science vessel and uncover the secrets of their abandoned ghost projects. If I can learn more about their mental conditioning, I can undo the damage their tinkering scientists have done to my mind. Though you be the favored servant of the Overmind, you would do well to remember that you are just a servant. You know of our grand mission, Kerrigan. Would you put your personal whims before the will of the Overmind? Do not cross me, Zaz. I will do as I see fit, and not you or any other Cerebrate shall stand in my way. Let her go, Zaz. The greatness of her spirit has been left to her, that the swarms might benefit from her fierce example. Fear not her designs, for she is bound to me as intimately as any Cerebrate. Truly, no Zerg can stray from my will, for all that you are lies wholly within me. Kerrigan is free to do as she desires. By your will, Overmind. Cerebrate, you must see that she comes to no harm. Was I, you know, going at it? Um, I think that you know, out of all the things in the Zerg, like they can, you know, work it down to a DNA level. But it's like, well, I need to go into this, uh, you know, scientific facility to make sure that they to 
fix the uh, mind controlling powers that they did on me. And like, but they. The Zerg worked on you on a microscopic level. You think that. I don't know. Beans. Well, whatever. Uh, that's our time. So, anyways, until next time. Let's play. And spay near your animals. And like, subscribe, and check out the videos. And thanks, Sam. Game will six of uh, Starcraft one. So thanks and see ya.